Welcome to level 19. But I'm, I'm glad it's here. I finally get to see the overworld and the ending and all the stuff that, um, that I haven't had a chance to look at during the extensive, not extensive, but uh, during the testing process. I feel like it's been a while. Voyager. It's out. It's under moderation and it's by Parahax. Uh, let's see if Para's done anything before. Would you look at that? Uh, Mario, the Curse of King Boo. Remember this one? This was an interesting little romp. But that's not what it's about today. Today it's about Voyager. The new one. It came out, uh, I guess technically today, within the last 24 hours. It is 24 exits, a fast-paced intermediate Kaizo hack with some puzzle elements and a light narrative. Interesting, because there was no puzzle element. There was that puzzle element in Coopersburg. Maybe that's what it means. Uh, aims to be somewhat a challenge for all Kaizo skill sets. Beginners be warned, I would agree with that. Custom graphics in the SNW style, which is cool. A light story to add theming and atmosphere. Just there for people that enjoy that sort of thing. You were just warned as people cry about puzzles. <laughs> they do, don't they? I might be included in that. Eight, eight secret portrait rooms. I don't know if I've found all of those yet. We'll see what they... We'll see a little, little bit of exploration. But the main focus is finishing it. Custom music. Music free file. Yeah, so inside the download there is a no music version. Uh, we will not be using that tonight. Checkpoint saves, which is good. Fast retry, which is fantastic. And your standard quality of life stuff. I assume your spin, uh, like your cape turn around, your uh, spin throw, uh, all that sort of stuff. No Kaizo blocks. No bosses. The occasional troll. Semi-open overworld. This is cool. So some slight puzzly setups. Hopefully that shouldn't be too much of an issue for me because I've played it before. Screenshots. Beautiful title screen to exit count displayed. This is the, the shell, the Koopa Dojo. Um, we've got, this is the first level, I think. The train level, which is a, a, a hit. I like this one. This is the, the chuck one. The, <laughs> the, right, the left level. We've got Akabona's Cabana. We know this one, that looks really nice. It's a good screenshot worthy of including. And there we go. So far, Scatman Jones saw the trailer Love the semi-puzzle aspect. If I ever get back into Kaizo, this will be the first one I'll hop into for sure. Did he play it? I'm not sure. <laughs> anyway, look, that's Voyager by Parahax. We're going to check it out. And by check it out, I mean I've, I I kind of know about most of the levels. I think I've I think I played... Well, who knows? Who knows? There might be some surprises for us. But I'm pretty sure I've seen the whole game. Might as well just start, huh? Voyager. New game. How many times have I played this intro sequence? <laughs> At least once a week, it feels. <laughs> bye bye, Yoshi. You are not coming on this voyage. Your vacation is cut short after crashing your ship against the cliffs of a mysterious land. Let this be a lesson never, I repeat, never sail on mushrooms. Let's have a look at the overworld. I didn't really see much of the overworld. Early in testing, we saw the overworld, but I was. Uh, Towards the end, we were just looking at like a testing overworld. So this is cool. Let's check out Shipwreck. Cheeseburger's here. Welcome. You may be in this game, Cheeseburger. This place doesn't seem to be on the map, but there's no turning back now. There's got to be some way back to the Mushroom Kingdom. Press select on the overworld to save your checkpoint at any time, says Parahax. So this is this is just the intro screen. All right, Yoshi should be... Uh, Yoshi should be, oh, oh, I guess there's no, it's a side exit. I guess we actually ditched him and he's uh, is off and found his own adventure. Okay. Okay, so what do we got? We got Sacred Grove and we got Lothlorien. So I know Lothlorien is the first level. Let's have a look at Sacred Grove. Oh, Mushroom Kingdom. Let's go home. Let's go straight to the Mushroom Kingdom. Unfortunately, it looks like this is a, a nexus of sorts. So there's no, um, there's no getting out of here, sadly. Alright. Exit. Okay, so three switches to get. 
can't do much until we do that. So we'll start the game with Lothlorien. The, um, yeah, the number platform level. This one was a fun, a fun one, if I recall. There are definitely some faces. Yeah, I've seen a couple of faces in the game in, in my testing. I didn't know there were eight, though. Eight is, uh... There's more than I've been counted, so I might I might have missed a bunch in my um in my testing. <laughs> to be fair, I don't know if I was exploring as much as maybe I should have been. There's definitely some jumps here. And how nerve-wracking is it when you release a hack and it's on SNW Central? Have you been like checking the page frequently over the last day? I know I would have been. Oh, is that good? That's a checkpoint. All right, nice. I feel like I'm really sweaty. What's going on? My controller is sweaty in my hand. It's this uh, intense platforming. I think it's getting to me. Ugh. Troll dodged. You glance at SNO section on Twitch a lot, right? Yeah. Okay. So, the path splits three ways. So, we can, um... Uh, there's three different factions that we can go and visit. We can visit Coopersburg. We can go hang out with the Coopers. We can travel down and visit, um... The Sumo Bros. And I think right... Let me just double check. Is um, I think right is Chuckland. Could be wrong. Yeah, right is Chuckland. So maybe just Coopersburg. I know, this is a good introduction because this level is relatively chill, if I remember. It's kind of a lore level to some extent. So we've got the uh, we've got the secret block that we can hit. And this is our, I believe this is our first introduction to level 19. <laughs> Welcome to level 19. <laughs> Everyone has found this so far. How many level 19s have people found? So level 19 is kind of a... If you go back in the pipe, it takes you back to the start. Your duty is to kill yourself in order to escape level 19. <laughs> and we'll uh, try and do that. There we go. According to plan, yeah. These curious explorers. Maybe not enough people got level 19 in Curse of King Boo. Um, so, what, did I miss any message boxes yet? Go in here. Only three? Ah. Let me have a think. Yeah, so we're at war with the Chucks, so we walled off at the town. If you want to leave, you need to find a way into the old clock tower. Fell for every troll. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Let me think. Level 19. So there's this one here. There's one in the ghost town. Ah, uh, there's... Uh, other ones that I can't remember. <laughs> There's probably... You would know. What's in here? I think we might find our first portrait if we go into this house. It's Rick! He is Rick. It's his birthday today. So, say happy birthday, Rick. There we go. <laughs> there we go. Portrait. The first portrait for today is Rick. Okay, so our objective is to leave, but we need to have a normal P switch and an item P switch. Gotta have both. And we need to find a way into the old clock tower, which is this. This is the old clock tower. I love the half pipe 
not half pipe, but you know, half the pipe tile that lets you know that you can enter the tower from above. And also the introduction that yes, if you carry a silver piece switch through a pipe, it becomes a normal one. This is a vanilla SW mechanic that some people may not know. It's good to know that, and it's kind of forced upon you to know about it. Yeah, perfect. The the pipe thing. Yeah, it was a hidden pipe. Okay. Whoops. That's uh, that's something to be aware of. Worth mentioning, I think. All right. Okay, so now we have both P switches. Uh, uh, well, that wasn't very smart, was it? All right. Up we go. So, there we go, the double. In we go. There used to be a really nasty troll here where something would land on your head. I'm glad that that's not there anymore. Also, Para, I don't know if you know about this, but if I were to leave, like th this area is side eggs and enabled. So I can go to the left and finish <laughs> and just exit the level. <laughs> Um, just some last-minute testing after release. Oh, that was Shovda's idea? <laughs> what a jerk. <laughs> this shrine is where we keep the golden shell of Cupius Maximus, our greatest hero. It's the town's most prized relic. Please don't die. <laughs> oh. <sighs> Had to show that. It is possible. I think I went too far against the right wall. There we go. Try it again. Don't die this time. Okay, just jump. Jump. Down we go. The uh, the husk of the P-switch got Sprite killed, which was nice. Okay, let's try again. We'll get, <laughs> get through the level. The shell of Cupius Maximus should be available here. Sure. Yeah, the little Cooper friend to come and hang out and escort me off the premises. All right, so now we got Palace Maximus. We'll keep going this route, this is fun. I love this, this is a cool level. In remembrance of Cupius Maximus, who returned his people to this sacred land after being exiled by Charlemagne the Cruel. Alright. Lovely. Uh, now, I understand that's from Paper Mario. I think you mentioned that at some point. That, uh, that dude, that sprite. Not sprite, but the, those tiles. You fail me, what's going on, man? It is from Paper Mario? Nice. And Grim read some of the war-related message box and was like, this game, <laughs> that Chuck is straight talking, talking straight genocide? Yeah. You checked it out last night? Man, what's, it's, it's just a bit too, what's wrong? What's wrong with Voyager? I had to, I don't know if you know about this, but I've been testing this for months. So I've I've gotten used to how the game is. Just are you talking about just the troll density? <laughs> it's it's uh it's pretty wild, man. Occasional trolls. <laughs> yeah, that that teal palace has occasional trolls. I think it's got more trolls than most games. <laughs> That's a good one.
Uh, is there going to be? Yeah, there might be a, a test on all the lore. Occasionally you won't get trolled, maybe. Yeah, like I I don't think there are any trolls on that path. Unless you count those high bouncing power coopers in an enclosed space, a troll. Uh, you didn't load it full of Kaizos. That's right, there's not heaps of Kaizos. There's not that many. We'll do Aero Walk. If you're, if you're a fan of, uh, of shooters, you know about Aero Walk. I can see a distant shore on the horizon. And there's smoke rising from it? No kidding. We gotta go find our friend. It's Kyowski. Everyone say hi to Kyowski. Uh, it can also be pronounced as Chowski or Kao Sky. There's many ways to pronounce it. I'm sure I'm getting it wrong. Anyway, there we go. There's, a, there's another portrait. <laughs> where, do, where was it, um, you fail me? Where, what, were you, what couldn't you figure out? Because I've gotten so used to this game that I, I, I kind of... I, I, <laughs> I, I can't imagine not knowing anymore. I'm a bad tester. Oh my goodness, for sure. Right, where's the saw? Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's it's a pretty brutal P-speed recatch, I think. Oreos is here. Okay, just hold right. Do a shell thing. Don't get bulleted. There we go, alright. White shirt equals lots of clips. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're in... There was... Oh, a one wall tile you could go inside. Yeah, some of those things might... Uh, we've had a couple of those, but I, I guess I didn't catch that one, sadly. That's unfortunate. Oh no, it's spin. <laughs> uh, you gotta go kind of fast here, I think. Uh, kind of slow. Yeah, look at how slow I am. Jeez. Everyone looks better in black and white. It's a fact. Who did we find? Uh, so far tonight we found Rick. And uh, Kowalski. I don't think I found anyone else yet. Ka um, he's... Uh, yeah, we found Kowalski in this level. Uh, what's down here? This is a fuzzy. Oh my god, I almost hit my head. and jump or you get trolled by the platform. Oh. Alright. Megiddo. Megiddo. Something. <laughs> Soldier! Why are you slacking behind? Get this bomb behind enemy lines ASAP. It's about to go off. Just give it a, if it's about to go off, just give it a kick in the ass. This level's cool, by the way. I'm gonna say that about most of the levels, but this one's really cool. <laughs> oh wait, uh, I, I just realized Oreos wanted me to go black and white. <laughs> I was kind of baiting it out and I didn't even pay attention. Alright, through the pipe, and we lose the bomb because we don't need it. Um, now, black and white, drink some water. Alright, let's do it. 
professional streamer. Guys, Muz is here. Muz is an Australian streamer, uh, like myself, but way more cool and funny. And some would say significantly more handsome. So, if you don't know about him, I would suggest uh, investigate. Hey, that's different. Hey, um, Parrot, you changed something there. When did you remove the turn blocks, you nasty nerd? There's supposed to be turn blocks, isn't there? Isn't there supposed to be turn blocks either side? Or, no, you're wrong. I'm confusing it for another level. Sorry, that was kind of uncalled for. <laughs> that was extremely uncalled for, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, look, here's, there's the turn blocks now. Wait, no, the turn blocks are there. Oh my God, I'm ridiculous. Okay, it's all, all my fault. I apologize a thousand times for calling you, whatever I said, a nasty nerd. <laughs> okay. Muz, I'm going alright. I'm really excited tonight because I've been testing this ROM hack um, for months. Every week I play a new version and Para keeps improving it, adding new stuff, and it's finally out. It came out uh, within the last 24 hours. It's called Voyager. Uh, it's 24 exits, it's kind of an intermediate thing, I reckon, you know, where would, where would I place it? It's kind of, I don't know, it's, it's well solidly in intermediate, but it's hard to say because I've played it so much that it feels easier than what it actually is, probably. 